Hey guys, Shelby here. Um, I just wanted to jump in for a video blog today. Um, and the reason I'm blogging today is because I'm thinking about the term endurance and what endurance means. And I recently was reading um, some material, my daily devotional actually, that um, was just talking about endurance and what it what it takes to really endure situations in our life and seasons in our life that aren't super fun. Um, and anyway, I just wanted to kind of talk on that a little bit today. So um, that being said, I just want to actually take a moment and talk about all of the um, heartache that's in our community of Goodland right now. Um, we've had some very, very terrible storms take place in the past couple of weeks um, with some really bad hail, wind, heavy rains, um, and and it you drive out into the rural area and you just see despair. And it's so sad because, you know, you know how much heart and soul and work and blood, sweat, and tears goes into uh, the the crops that are being put into the ground and you know that means for those farmers that could mean you know taking time away from their families taking time um from friends you know and just working so 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 hard just to have something in the blink of an eye taken away from you um and so i think that that term endurance can really play in right now um and I think, I think we need to think of endurance in terms of physical aspects, um, emotional aspects, and uh, mental aspects of uh, endurance and what it means to endure. And what it means to endure to me is um, the ability to get through a certain season that just seems so hard and so there's so much just like you just, it's not gonna, it's not gonna get better. And it's really hard to keep a positive mindset and keep, um, a smile on your face by all means. Um, and so I just kind of, I think of that in all terms. I think of that at our studio when we're, you know, enduring seasons, that could be like a hard class. Um, you know, the kids pushing through, uh, plank or a really tough routine and enduring and just knowing that they're going to come out stronger and better at the end. Um, and I think that's, that's endurance all the way, you know, it's, it's the ability to pursue or not pursue, but persevere and just make it through a situation knowing that you're going to come out stronger when it's all said and done. Um, and I think it's really hard to, to think like that because we have no idea what's, what's at the end of that road. We have no idea what's at the end of that season. And so it's, it's scary. It's, uh, intimidating for sure. Um, when you think in terms of, so that's the physical aspect. When you think in terms of an emotional, um, aspect, you know, and a mental aspect, those are, those can be lots of things. Those can have to do with your relationships. They can have anything to do with, um, maybe it's a tough season you're in with your job or a tough season you're in with, you know, um, health, anything like that. It's, it's the idea that you have to put in your mind positive, positive thoughts, um, it helps having positive people around, um, you know, surround yourself with good people. And if you can't find someone that's real close to you, it's okay. Go to the internet and start watching videos. Uh, I do that often. You know, I find myself looking for TED Talks just on maybe a something that I'm dealing with on that day that I just need a little bit of inspiration. So, but that's, that's so, something that I knew when I started Soul Step in Studio and wanted to start my blog is I wanted to be that inspiration to people and show people that, you know, life isn't always pretty. It doesn't always make you want to talk highly about it. Uh, it's hard. It's really hard. But 
It's the idea that if we can endure those tough seasons and those hard moments and situations that we're going to come out a hundred times better um, as a person than we could ever have imagined. So with that being said, I just want to wish everyone um, a happy rest of your Sunday. I hope you're spending it with friends or family or even if you're just hanging out on your own. I hope I hope you all feel peace today um, knowing that this this season shall pass. I that's that's one of my favorite quotes of all time is this too shall pass. You know, it's 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 just so true and it's it will pass. The time will go and you'll move on to a better time. So it's the idea of just hanging in there. So I just want to wish you all the best and I hope you have a great week and so many exciting things are happening. We have our first week of summer classes. We can't wait to see all the new faces that are joining Soul Step in Studio and our new schedule. And so uh, many, many exciting things to come from Soul Step in this summer. So I look forward to talking with you guys soon. Have a great day. Bye-bye.